Let's create a play. First thing you do is to select the sport you want to create a play for. I'm going to say football. And you log in. Use the menu option and select the create a play button. And name the play. And give the number of offensive players and the number of defensive players. Now note, these numbers are uh, intelligent numbers, so they're, depending on the sport that you've selected, um, will depend on the total number of max and min numbers that you can put. Uh, within football, for example, I can have as many as 11 players uh, or as few as zero. I'm just trying to show one uh, side of the ball or the other side of the ball. In this case, I'm just going to do a simple five on five. And you push the next time point button. So you'll arrange the plays, uh, the players in, in the order that you want them to be in. So I'm going to do trips right. And then uh, run. So I've uh, arranged my offensive players. I'm going to arrange my defensive players uh, in a similar way. Now note that you can change the uh, the player's text, so what's inside the box or the circle, uh, by selecting the player and you can change it. And you can also allow the players to talk. So I'll do that with the quarterback. I'll say from the get-go, uh, this is the very first section, everybody's all set. So now I'm going to go to the next time point. So this is time point one to two. Okay. So I'm going to select on my quarterback. I'm going to have him say ready. And I'll update that, and you can see he's saying ready. And when he says ready, uh, my, my running back's going to move. But let's go to the next time point. So he'll set, get set, say ready, next time point. My running back will come and stand right next to him. Okay. Now, next time point. I have my quarterback say, down, set, hike. Okay. And while he's doing that, the defender is going to have reacted to the running back coming over here. All right. I'm going to go to my next time point. Okay. So hike, and the ball comes to the quarterback. And then the next time point. Again, these time points are not intended to be seconds, so don't think of them as seconds. They can be looked at that way. But it's just moments in time, snap snapshots of time plays going on. Next time point. Uh, all the players are going to start to do something because the ball was snapped. So I'm going to take uh, my wide receiver that's all the way to the right. I'm going to push him up the field a few yards. And his defender is going to react. I do this just by clicking and dragging on the players. Okay. I'm going to have my center I'll do a short slant. You're going to see his defender is going to react. All the while, I have a blitzer. Now this guy is going to start to blitz. All right. So my running back is going to push forward. And the quarterback is either going to hand him the ball or he's not going to hand him the ball. So he's going to slide the ball forward. And this is kind of dependent upon whether or not he sees a blitzer. In this case, we do see a blitzer. So, he's going to pull the ball back. In this time point, the running back is going to run through. Blitzer is still coming. At that point, you want to have this running back start to run across. Number four, still moving up the field, try to pull his defender away. Number five, still running the slant this way. Really trying to create some confusion here with all these defenders. So what I'm going to hope is that the blue, number two, we're going to take the blue A, 
with him as a defender. We're hoping that that guy thinks he got the handoff. So we'll go to our next time point. Blue number two runs this way. Hoping A comes with him. And as number three comes through, he's going to take a handoff. Next time point. Two keeps running this way. He keeps going this way. Four still going up the field. Five still slanting. And three now will start up the field in this direction. Next time point. Everything's still happening. I'm just going to kind of finish off number three. At this point, generally, I don't try to do too much trying to tell the players how to run or where to run. Uh, leave that up to them as the athletes. Next time point. And we'll save this. And that's how you create a play in the awesome playbook.